I have an interesting story to share with you today. First of all, I wanted to say this before I even get into it. The image that's on your screen is from Paul Reznikoff of digitalmusicnews.com. You know, he wanted to make sure that anybody who shares this image uses it under the Creative Commons attribution. So I wanted to make sure that I let you know where exactly where it came from. This is from Paul Reznikoff from digitalmusicnews.com. I did not make this image, so it's theirs. Just want to make sure that I give the information that you need to know who the rightful owner is so if you see it anywhere and they don't mention Paul Reznikoff and Digital Music News they done stole it and that's not how we do things out here we make sure we give proper accreditations okay so anyways Paul Reznikoff wrote an article on the digitalmusicnews.com website digitalmusicnews.com and the article was titled title says they're paying artists five times as much as Spotify as you can see on the screen it says per stream payout Spotify versus title and that little itsy bitsy shit on the left side of the screen is what Spotify pays and then we have title over here which is of course Jay-Z's amazing music service that's out there in Sweden and but they're here in America if you wanted to sign up and listen to some really good music on title T-I-D-A-L title.com Shout out to Uncle Hove, Jay-Z, God MC. Anyways, I want to read to you the article that Mr. Reznikoff wrote. And then I'll give my honest opinion. <laughs> Digitalmusicnews.com writes, and I quote, Last week, Digital Music News published a real royalty statement from a really reliable source showing titles per stream royalty payouts, which average 0.0. .0 144 or 1.44 cents per stream for an independent label now title says that statement isn't correct and they are actually paying double that amount this is not one of titles royalty statements in quote the company told digital music news in an official statement this morning quote for the same period March of 2015 as this purported quote leaked statement title paid an average royalty per stream of 0 0.24 to 0 0.028 or double the royalty shown in the statement end quote title is definitely correct on one point technically this isn't a statement mailed from them because they don't mail statements directly to smaller labels and artists. Rather, the statement was issued by a digital distributor serving the independent label in question, which is norm for the industry. In the same statement, Spotify's <laughs> per stream royalty averaged 0.0048 or 0.48 cents per stream. That fits industry numbers of approximately half a penny per stream, though Spotify itself has claimed a higher 0 0.7 cents per stream, which has never been verified as accurate. End quote. Wow. So let's get this straight. Spotify versus Tidal. Tidal's paying five times the amount. Do you see why? As a musician, I'm on Jay-Z's side. Jay-Z, the God MC, Jehovah, is looking out for artists. But y'all playing around, talking crap, trying to do whatever you can to sabotage this man. And companies are willing to pay millions of dollars to mess with Hove too. Because Hove is the king. And between him and the queen, Beyonce, they're going to figure this all out. They're going to come out winning. I mean, are you going to be on the winning side? I know this. Not only is Tidal the streaming service for everyone to sign up to right now, when I put my music out, guess who I'm putting it out with? Tidal, T I D A L, Tidal.com. Why? Because Jigga and The Rock are behind it. I mean, come on now. It's Jigga Jay Z. You crazy? I mean, who wouldn't want to be down with Jay? You're going to go. It's, what is, you see. This is why he said that the industry needs to be taken over. This is why he said that, you know, people were not being paid what they're supposed to be paid. They're being paid far less than what they could be paid and what they should be paid. This is exactly what he was talking about. This is irrefutable proof right here of why Hove was right again. God MC, Jehovah. All right.
Y'all not ready for war, little soldier? Jay-Z is letting you know. Listen, if you listen to his lyrics, you listen to what he says in his interviews, you listen to what he says on stage, Jay is telling you the game. It reminds me of what 50 Cent said in the song. He said, I be giving y'all the game. You got to listen, man. That's the thing. Y'all don't listen. You just go with your emotions. You're like, man, Jay-Z's rich enough. Spotify made billions. You don't think they're rich enough? Let's make Jay-Z a billionaire. Let's do the right thing. He's paying the artist five times a month. And then you might say, well, oh, what do I care for? All those people are rich anyway. I tell you what, you vote for Democrats. You vote for Republicans. You go out there and you vote and those people are rich. You're making them richer. You want to put them in office. Presidents make millions of dollars when they leave office. Some of that money is paid by our taxes. You know, we pay for a lot of things. You know, music is life and life is music, whether you want to realize it or not. That's why you come out the womb screaming. Those babies are singing. That's why the doctors smack them on their behind if they're not singing. It's just what people do. People sing. Okay. We have a voice for a reason. And Jay-Z, once again, was right. We need to make sure that we pay these musicians as much as possible because (laughs) if they get paid more money, then they're just going to make more music, rather make better music. Because right now, a lot of people are just putting out a lot of hot garbage. They're just trying to sell records. They're just trying to make a buck. And if they weren't struggling so much to sell records and to make money, then who knows what type of music they will be releasing. In theory, if we go ahead and we make sure we we support the artists since they're trying to support us by making music and entertainment for us, you know, to give us something to listen to, something to rock to, something to vibe to, you know, one hand washes the other. So let's look out for the musicians for once, okay? Sign up for title, do some business with them, get the streaming service, students get half off, and that's the way it is. All the smart people and all the cool people are doing it. Shout out to Jay Z and Beyonce, one of the greatest celebrity couples of all time. All damn time. But this is all my opinion. Let me know what you think about it all below. Be sure to subscribe to the Meat Magazine YouTube channels and visit meatmagazine.blogspot.com for more. Shout out to Hove and Queen Bee and Title, the greatest streaming service of all time, full Meat Magazine.